Students and staff returned to Louisville High School this morning after 17 year old Skylar Linson was shot and killed right off of campus yesterday. Yeah, this all happened in a parking lot of a fast food restaurant that's nearby. Police caught the gunman, who we learned is a juvenile, a short time later. Our Nick Starling joins us live outside the high school where classes resume today. But Nick, I can imagine that it's a heavy feeling there at the school. Very much so. Classes started about 40 minutes ago, and as you can imagine, it's a very emotional day. You can even see it on the students' faces as they headed in a class here at Louisville High School behind me, especially those students who knew Skyler. Now, if you take a look at this video, you can see a lot of the students are wearing black. We are told that was Skyler's favorite color. There is ramped up security here on school campus today as well to make sure everybody is safe. Now, police tell us the shooting happened just off campus in the parking lot of a Raising Cane. Just as school was letting out after 4 p.m. Police tell us a suspected gunman drove off after this shooting, followed by a good Samaritan who called police with updates about his location. And the alleged shooter was then caught shortly after. Police say the alleged shooter is a juvenile and did not go to Louisville High School. I spoke with a student who knew Skyler and a woman who dropped off her sister and both described this heartbreaking tragedy. I kind of broke down crying, but like... It was more sadness than anything because he was like so genuine and so sweet to everyone. And it like threw like everyone off guard, just like that it happened in front of so many people and that people had to witness that. They said that it was going to be like more security, but still, I feel like there's not enough security to handle like all, like so many kids. And like you never know like what goes through people's mind. And it's, it's a different day, like every day. So you never know and if anything can happen. But yeah, it's scary to drop, drop her off. Now, Louisville ISD said there will be school security on staff as well and more counselors made available for any students or staff who need to talk over this very tragic situation. Now, in terms of a motive, police have not released anything on that yet. However, they do say that the victim and the suspect do know each other and this was not a random shooting. Live in Louisville, Nick Starling, CBS News, Texas.